Will you promise to join with each other in creating a home that will endure in love and peace? If so, answer, I will. I will. Do you understand that the following vows you are about to exchange have no conditional clauses in them and are declared in God's presence? And now, John and Emily, you have written your own vows you may now exchange with each other. Emily, you came into my life when I expected it least and when I needed it most. You are truly an amazing woman, and I love you with all that I am. You have a wonderful combination of an adventurous personality and a loving soul. I never would have thought that one conversation in a college library could change my life. While we met by chance, it was no accident that your tender love has helped me to be a better man. Along the way, we have learned to turn challenges to our relationship into opportunities to strengthen our foundation. I have learned that true love is being totally vulnerable and completely selfless. While marriage will involve big decisions regarding children and finances, I am undaunted. In the end, as your husband, I promise to love you with a tenderness and selflessness that you have taught me until I am no more. My love, words cannot describe the joy I have for being here today and marrying the best man I know. You have become my safe place, my home, my one person to weather the storms with. God has truly favored me when he gave me you. I have prayed for you my whole life, even on the day we first met. You have made me a better person just by knowing you. You show me every day through your actions of how you love me, and I love you so much too. And I hope you know I will be with you when we weather the storms. I will be your study when you are feeling unsteady, the love when you're feeling unlovable. I promise to always be honest with you and be a supporting presence to lean on. I promise to be a good friend and confidant to you and I promise to love you with my whole being. I can't wait to be your wife and partner in life. Dear friends, let us continue to love one another, for love comes from God, and anyone who loves is a child of God and knows God, but anyone who does not love God does not know God, for God is love. And having pledged your faith and love to each other, and having sealed your vows with the exchanging of rings, you are now husband and wife in the sight of God. Let people everywhere recognize and respect this holy union now and forevermore. Kiss that girl.